Hi, I'm Catherine O'Doherty and I'm the No Limits Project Manager for the Visually Impaired team. We've been running a lot of activities now that have involved taking groups of children out to participate in activities that they might not get the chance to otherwise. I'm Steve Thompson, I work as a teacher for the Education League Visually Impaired team. We're here today with a group of visually impaired students uh, trying to give them an experience that hopefully they haven't had before but hopefully we'll want to do again. I think this means a lot to the children because quite often we find that the children don't get exposure to things like this. What we'd like them to do is to try these things out with us and then perhaps see if they're sustainable so get their parents on board, come and try it again and hopefully it'll develop into not just a social thing but a hobby they can do at weekends and in the evenings. We've been doing a lot of activities this week, uh, which we've been having filmed just to give parents and the other young people a taster of everything that we do over the course of the project. In the last week we've been skateboarding, BMXing, singing, DJing, breakdancing, ice skating, bowling and lots of other things. Um, we have regular clubs that meet for under fives, five to nines and upper primary and then secondary pupils. So there's lots of activity going on all the time. I'm head of the sensory service in Education Leeds. It's really important for these children to try and break through some barriers and just to try to make sure that they can do things that all children love to do. Everybody loves to glide on ice, it's a lovely feeling with the air on your face, everybody adores that, so it's really important that these children have a chance to just have a go like everybody else lovely for, for the parents to, to be here and all the other children to just do that family thing, enjoying something really fun together. My name's Abby, I'm the mum of um, two girls, Evie and Amy, and we use the visual impairment team um, my daughter Amy since she's been born. We are invited to come along and um, meet other families with visual impairments and just have good fun. First time she's tried it, so it's a really great opportunity for her to try things that she wouldn't normally try. I just um, hope these sort of events keep carrying on as Amy gets older, so she keeps in touch with children at different schools across the city. They're doing you know, the same things to her, like Braille, and it's just great for her to do activities to support. I think it's really important uh, for the young people taking part in these projects to have these activities um, because it just gives a very different experience of, of activities that are going on um, and it gives them a chance to socialise with their peers and uh, explore uh, their mobility and independence in different surroundings. That's what I'm talking about. Try my best to do it. Like I've gone to skate park, but it's easier here with the coach. Like we put them really well to help me get better. I've just got a skateboard at home. It turns out I'm really good at it. I've gotten much better at it, and I can go down some of the big ramps now. The purpose of this video was to show all the parents and staff that we work with the variety of activities that we do because not everyone can come to everything, to give the young people a chance to see how they can progress and the different activities they'll be able to take part in as they get older and also to hopefully raise awareness of the great work that we've been doing as part of the visually impaired team and hopefully raise some more funding for future activities like this. To contact the No Limits Visually Impaired team at Leeds City Council, please call us on 0113 
395 11 11.